Follow me. He waiting. WNS, N54, even the pirate networks. You blown up everywhere. And the Jackster, he out in the car? Yeah, he's there. Dead. Condolences, friend. And the relic. No such luck. Hmm. That's one piece of good news. Good news. Saburo Arasaka. Dead. You got any notion of the shit you pulled me into? You off the fucking Emperor! His Majesty! Anyone with so much as a pinky toe dipped in this mess is as good as dead! You're the one who got us into this mess! Let's start with your prep work! You had no idea Saburo Arasaka would be at the hotel? I don't have access to his personal fucking schedule. And besides, nobody asked you to kill the old man. That wasn't us! No shit! Tell that to the Sokka ninjas they send after you! Alright, settle down. Gotta be tactical about this. New place, new identity. But first, your face got blood all over it. Bathroom's there. Go get yourself cleaned up. Could be. Remember yes! our first what combo? The fuck? Seems I've chosen the quiet life after all. No blaze of glory for me. Tonight, I'm... I'm here to say goodbye to all of you. Wasting your lives following us around like dogs. We're crawling Johnny, in your ass. Wait up. Don't do this. You could still change your mind. Get over here, man. Fuck this band. Not your crowd, not your noise. Do your own thing. Bastard. 
Gonna miss you something awful. See you in the next life, friend. Payload on the elevator. Arm it. Let gravity do its thing. Explosion rocks the foundation. Tower crumbles. Chaos. Screaming roll credits. Exit window's gonna be tight. Jacking in. The grass green. Birds fly. Cats eat bats. Rats shit gnats. Mainframe's not your playground, Murphy. Come on. Evac announcement. Broadcast it across all frequencies and let's get moving. Sheesh. Who wrote this manifesto? Really need me to answer that question? Jesus, Johnny. You've gone off the deep end. That's coming from a chair jock. Come on. Get ready. Spend the whole fucking lot of this. Bushido 2, bomb's name was what? Wrap it up! We got a Delta! The Demolitron. We're good to blow. Shaka Elite incoming! Out of there, Run Johnny. for it! Shoot the cables! Get the rotors spinning! We're on our way! Not done yet. Still need to feed this to their subnet. Knew it. This was never about corporate colonialism. This was about your groupie output, wasn't it? 
No, you wouldn't understand, Rogue. Giving you four fucking minutes. Chopper's not gonna wait one sec longer. Door lock breached. Arasaka sons of bitches incoming. Love you, Spider. All world loves me. in on the access point. Slide in. Sweet icebreaker. Foreign, right? Just wonder if we know anyone who can switch the subnet protocol. Hilarious. You gonna help or not? Do spiders spin webs? It's time we caught some flies. Thanks, Murph. Now, just for good measure. Holy cyber cow. We're on TV. Take a we look. turn now to Arasaka Tower. It's evacuation ongoing after an unidentified terrorist organization released a manifesto threatening violence. The terrorists stating their desire to, quote unquote, topple a monument to corporate colonialism. Night City's mayor, Mbole Ebunike, has issued a statement declaring that he will bring the full force of the law to bear in response to any act of terrorism. Going now to our reporter on the scene at Arasaka Tower. Hopefully he can shed some light on the situation as events unfold. All set. Now get out of there. They're moving up. Hit the roof quick. Johnny boy, told you I'd end you someday. Let us try once more. You associates, who are they? How did you acquire fistful material? Gonna give good cop over there a chance to say something? Come on. Which terrorist organization do you belong to? How did you acquire fissile material? Ugh. <laughs> Boss, don't look too pleased with your efforts. Hazusi, çoksetsiz anlaşıyorsun. and gone. My husband died in that tower. But there are fates worse than death. I didn't want him to die. 
なぜこのようなこと Why did you do this? To bring an end to the madness you wreak. 人は嘘をつき自分自身を欺くだが死者は違う死者は雄弁だが彼らは決して嘘をつかない死者の言葉にはつつましさがある始めろ And you, who are you? Heavier than she looks. Now, listen, dog. I have done exactly what you asked. So, lest you and me figure this out. Arasaka sama, Oto sama no sasugai hama is kemisha. Kono onna de machi ga yari masen. Hai. 一時間後には着くかと怖い
れ Don't you dare faint again. Keep your eyes open. <laughs> we both could use medical attention. Do you know a Reaper Doc whom you can trust? I know. Someone. We must get to Ripadok. Quickly! Victor... Who will fix us up? We have to get there somehow! Call someone! Anyone! All right, all right. Greetings. My scanner indicates you are outside the service area. Just... Come pick me up. Need to get to Misty's Esoterica in front of Vex. Of course. A vehicle is en route. It should arrive in less than 20 minutes. What are you doing? Hey! The personal link is damaged. Please proceed to insert the jack below the ear, though not too deep. There should be auxiliary neurosockets between her lymph nodes, beneath the SCM muscle. If I hit the vein by mistake, she will die. Indeed, as she will if you do nothing. I think I have the socket. Now proceed to connect. Let's get her inside. I cannot hold it. I need to rest. That your blood? Misty! Precious tanking! It's neurogenic shock. She's dying. Gotta cut my way through the occipital bone. No other way. There is risk of... I know what I'm doing. Slower on the men than you, but looking better every day. Describe them to me. Blinding lights. It's loud. I'm on stage and almost can't breathe. I'm so damn full of hatred. And then I let it all out into a mic 
And I realize it didn't help. I don't feel any better. And then... <laughs> promise not to laugh. I plant a bomb in Arasaka Tower. Nothing there to laugh about. Night City looked different. Strange. And I... I hated it. Hated everybody. Every inch. It was too real. Even for a lucid dream. You weren't dreaming, V. Those were memories. There's a personality construct on that shard. Dreams you had were from his past. Hang on. I mean to say there's an actual terrorist in my head right now. That's right. Johnny Silverhand. Had his crowning moment about 50 years ago. AHQ bombing. Heard of it? It's his doing. People say he was buried under the rubble. <sighs> anyway, that's not what's important right now. Never given me that look before, Vic. What is it? You, uh... Don't got a lot of time left, kid. Say what now? The biochip. It's basic a bomb. Fuse lit already. You don't have much time left. Much life. A few weeks tops. Silverhand's construct is overriding your consciousness. Gradually taking over your body until one day you'll just be gone. V, it's important you get all this. You'll fix me up, right, Vic? If I could, I would, V. Believe me. But this is... It's way beyond what I know how to do. You're the best of the best, Vic. Why can't you help me? You want the long story or the short? Don't omit a thing. Not one deep. Okay. There was, is, a construct. A psyche on the chip. That of Johnny Silverhand. You jacked it in your chip slot. Nothing happened, right? Until you died. Bullet in the head from Dexter Deshaun. How do you come back from something like that? Low caliber. You lucked out. Not least thanks to another poor decision by Mr. Deshaun. The nanites off the chip started fixing the damage. Then they took your hand and coaxed you off the path toward the light. People don't just die and then get up like nothing happened. Used to be true. Now it's only if they don't have a classified piece of corpo tech primed to resurrect them. What about me? My psyche? I make it back from the other side and what? I'm supposed to pretend change is normal? Ask the Arasaka engineers who built the thing. All I know is, your mind's gonna go. And it won't be pretty. From the biochip's perspective, your brain cells are a tumor that needs to be scooped out. While your body's an empty shell to hold the construct. So this fucking terrorist wants to wipe me and take my place, take my body. It's not willful on his part, it's automatic, inevitable, and neither of you can stop it. Can we just take the chip out or s switch it off? Either way is out of the question. You die immediately. Vic, you've always come through for me. If there's nothing you can do to help me, then... What the hell do I do? Tell me, please. Vic. I wish I knew, kid. Misty? You're asking too much from an old-timer like Vic. Come on, V. 
Let's get you home. And then he died. And I thought I was gonna die with him in my sleep. Sleep's a small hint of death, the inevitable. Can't actually tell if I'm awake now. I mean, I could be dead already, right? Not something to focus on, V. Let it go. Here, got some meds for you. Omega blockers. Taken regularly, they'll keep things from progressing too quickly. Also, they should keep that guest of yours calm and quiet. Pseudoendotrizines from me. Effect will be opposite. It'll speed things up. Free the demon, so to speak. Gotta lie down. Here, got one more thing for you. Vic pulled this out of your skull. A lucky charm? Promise you'll try to get some sleep? Misty, wait. Um, about Jackie. Yeah? He talked about you. Like, lots. We got into a fight. Right before he went off to do this job. He wasn't mad at you. I hope you know that. I know. I just wish our last moments together could have been... different. But right now, you need rest. So sleep. Please sleep. to get out of here, understand? And I'll kill anyone who gets in my way, you included. Need a smoke. Where'd you stash yours? Where did you even come from? How are we even talking? How the fuck should I know? The fuck kind of joy toy are you supposed to be? Fucking ghost off! Ah! Who you work for, start talking! Fuck! Fuck. Fucking chip. Rip the thing out myself. No, wait.
See you never, asshole. Now like that, stick some iron in your mouth and pull the trigger. I can feel it. Our minds touch on you. I'm like mold on fruit creeping into you. Nothing I can do about it. You hear me? I'd puke if I fucking could. It's just a copy of the engram. I'm out there somewhere. Gotta be. Jebra here. We must meet. Come to Tom's diner. Why would I do that? Because I am the one who saved your life. Haven't managed to get my head straight yet. Not after everything that happened. That will not happen anytime soon. And so what? If you intend to leave, you must re-enter the ring. The bell has already told. Thomas Diner, I am waiting. Just trouble. Usual stuff. Ah, ah. Uh, I need an iron and lead, then I take it. If anything, you can take 
Sure. Let me see what you got. do not look so bad. Then, in the car, I doubted you would survive. What's it you actually want from me? To begin, you must tell me where to find Evelyn Parker. Evelyn? What's she to you? She and Yorinobu Arasaka had intimate relations. She knows how to get to him. 
been thinking I ought to have a word with her myself. She promised to help me get rid of the chip. I would not count on that. She's likely gone very far away. Why you figure she skipped town? I tried to locate her, but had no success. I suspect she covered her tracks. You said Parker could help you remove the relic. Does she work for a corporation? Suspect so, yeah. Evelyn was knowledgeable about the relic. Had a large chunk of classified info. An enigma, to be sure, but... She showed that slyness you get in corpo agents. You know the kind. I too possess this slyness you speak of. You got tossed out, lumped with the outcasts, easily. Or have you forgotten? <sighs> Is that all? Really should be going. Wait. Yorinobu Arasaka must answer for this crime of patricide. <laughs> Looking for justice? In Night City? I seek revenge. Much more feasible here. I have allies prepared to bring Yorinobu to his knees. The only thing I need is proof. And you think they'll trust the word of a merc? I have nothing better now. Also, I know no one here. And I am a fugitive. I am hunted. What if I say no? Then I will tell you what rewards await if you help me. So what, we stroll into Arasaka HQ and announce that Yorinobu's a kin killer? That he murdered Saburo? We'll get the hearing before reasonable people in a neutral location. Certain procedures will be used to establish the truth. A lie detector? Forget it. In that case, another option. You are dying. You do not know how to save yourself. A chip, the relic, is a culprit. Technology made by Arasaka. Technology they alone know. This corporation can save you as easily as it can make you disappear. It is merely about getting the right people on your side. Politics. You mean people like Anders Hellman? You know this name? How? Prepped for the heist thoroughly. Relic is Hellman's design, his creation. And true, he's a pawn. I was thinking of one much more powerful. Besides, Anders Hellman escaped to Arasaka, betrayed it. Now, Hanako-sama, I would first like to ask you... Fucking Saka scums everywhere. Hey! I was listening to that! Shut up! Nobody except you wants to watch that shit about that corpo cunt. What did you say? You heard me. Let it go, Takamura. At least one of you's got some fucking sense. Thanks for the offer. Need to think about it. Get back to you. I need time to plan, organize. You stand to gain much if you help me. All I ask is that you do not leave the city. Leave? Why would I leave? Need help. Best chance I'll find the right person here. Someone other than Arasaka specialist? There's no one. No alternative. Actually, we just talked about some. With a bit of luck, I'll track down Evelyn. If she could not help you before, she will not manage to now. Honor among thieves. Ever heard of it? Yes, I thought it ironic. Thieves have none. There's just honor, I believe. You're an Obu Arasaka degree? I'm sure. The Parker woman will not help you. Why are you? I would think about the plan B. 
With a bit of luck, I'll track down Evelyn. If she could not help you before, she will not manage to now. Honor among thieves. Ever heard of it? Yes, I thought it ironic. Thieves have none. There's just honor, I believe. You're an Obu Arasaka degree? I'm sure. The Paka woman will not help you. Why are you? I would think about the plan B. Anders Hellman. He invented the relic. If I want to get rid of it, he's my man. And if that means picking another fight with Arasaka, so be it. Hellman defected from the company. I myself spent many days looking for him. He... What's the expression? Dropped off the face of the earth. Hmm, somebody's been busy the last few days. I will not sit and do nothing when there is information to be found. Things to prepare. Your job, basically. It was my job. Why are you looking for Hellman? He was the one to alert Saburo-san to Yorinobu's schemes. He knew both of them well and could be an important witness. Corporal rats squeal when hanging by their tails. For several days, I collected the information. All leads point to one place, the club called the Afterlife. I was quickly dismissed by the queen of fixers there, Rogue. She take you for a suit? No. She saw me as Saburo-sama's killer. Rogue's well informed. Gets wind of most things that happen in the city. Might be worth asking her about Hellman. I wish you luck. The old man is choosy, expensive, and rude. I cannot stay here any longer. Do what you want. Look for Parker, Hellman, whoever. I must see some friends. Call in some favors. When my people in Arasaka are ready to listen, I will call you. Till then, I guess. If by some miracle you find Hellman, please notify me. He and I have unfinished business. Zapper dumples and filth. In some ways, Night City never changes. Arasaka's still a despotic machine, and the world's on a collision course with chaos. But hey, at least Rogue's still alive. You know, you've got some nerve. First you're out to kill me, now you want to be my pal make like nothing happened? You know you don't gotta speak out loud to talk to me. What do you want? And I've processed some shit, changed my mind. Don't watch it dead anymore. Go fuck yourself, dick wipe. Hey, wasn't easy for me either. You woke up in a landfill, I woke up in your head. Wrestling with your thoughts, memories. Think we're even. And I've taken a step back, looked at things. Think we might be able to help each other. We could start with Rogue. Her and I go back to the Stone Age. You are the ghost of Christmas past, asshole. Any friends you've had are either dead or so old their memory's gone. Johnny Silverhand died a legend. Nobody forgets that. So you fucking know Rogue. What would I say to her? I got a talking brain tumor claims it's her old friend Johnny? Trust me, Rogue's heard dumber shit than that. Way back when you weren't even an itch in your daddy's ball sack. Don't need convincing. Seen your memories. Gross. Rogue will dance to any tune I play, or just get us to the afterlife. There is no us. <laughs> <laughs>